Raf Simmons has been partly responsible for the character of menswear over the past 20 years. And with his show tonight, you could see him playfully reclaiming his legacy for himself. I'm seeing a lot of interesting pieces. Raf Simmons always comes with a, a rather unique perspective on fashion. Definitely a lot of inspiration in there, a lot of good things that I saw. Like an accessible onesie, perhaps. <laughs> Probably only behind closed doors, but maybe more of the top, some of the shirts, some of the sweaters were a nice look and things like that. It was a lot about form experiment and to not necessarily feel the obligation to be dressed in a uniform. It was very much about the freedom that a man has to express himself. In a certain way they were in a clashing contrast. They were very different from the beauty and the perfection of architectural structures of Jean Prouvé. So I found it fascinating. Now you have so much history with Raf that when you see a show like that, do you see your history in that show? Totally. We've known each other for like 25 years. I think for the moment in the younger designers out there you see so much Raf Simmons influences that he's completely owning it, and at which, which he should. I mean, every person that is that influential should own his or her own past. No, I'm doing men's only with my brand. What is now the most natural thing, and that is for me the baby, you know, like when we were, when we were born, it's the most natural thing. There was the pure nature aspect of it. And obviously when I started doing my collection 18 years ago, there was a lot of link to a young generation. And I think that tonight we wanted to show that freedom again.